isn't that hard. Do you know Raleigh Fingers? He pitched for the A's? No. Well, I'm the spitting image of him. Oh, wait, is he the guy with the snidely whiplash thing going on from, from the 70s? Ooh, my dad loved him. Yeah, that's him. That mustache. Mm. Now you have my attention. Ah! Okay. Okay, well, that gives me a good start. Now let's see. In my scope, I can only tell you... I can only tell you're a white guy wearing shorts. It's hot. And maybe, by the way, I'm not white. It's not very, uh, you know, PC or whatever they say. Oh my god, you are the whitest man. Well, I don't need a spotting scope for that. And if not shorts, then what do you normally like to wear? Hey guys, Barry here, and welcome back to Firewatch on Nintendo Switch Part 3. This can't be that hard. Uh, I don't know. I like to look nice, usually. Well, I try now, I guess. Hmm. Had a bit of a schlubby period, did we? Yeah, a good 25, 30 years, yeah. But, um, <laughs> now you'll put on a, a clean shirt? Yeah, well, I, I have one that I got for Christmas, actually. Just, um, it's navy with white buttons, but I, I like it. I don't wear it that much, though. Well, it sounds just perfect. Now tell me about your face. I'm looking at you across the bar. What do I see? Uh... Hmm. A pretty thick beard. Oh. Have you always had a beard? For a while, yeah. Alright. Yes, he was born that way. <laughs> I want to know about your eyes. Get out of here. I'm drawing you. I need to know. Your what? Is, is that okay? Uh... Don't... <laughs> Don't answer. I'm going to do it regardless. Fine. Your eyes. Tell me. They look tired, I think. Oh, yeah? Yeah, you know, you hit a certain age and you just... You think you're a younger person who just looks tired all the time. <laughs> Speak for yourself, mister. But I guess that's getting old. Well, some people might see distinguished. You get what you need? Absolutely. Okay, anyway, yeah. Again, welcome back. We board up now. Let's see. I'm trying to remember what I did last time. Hello. I guess. Oh yeah, I think there's more wood downstairs. I'll bet to get some more wood. Here we go. So we need to get a couple more boards here. Boardy, boardy. Yeah, would you guys be interested in a comparison? I guess a visual comparison? Uh, PS4, Switch, and maybe PC? more I think yeah unfortunately the yeah the Xbox one X version was meant to get like a upgrade but that's been cancelled now unfortunately but uh, I would have bought it there as well but I have a PS4 and there's actually pro enhancements so Unfortunately, I can't record in 4K, but unless I get a 4K recorder, capture card, 
if you guys want to get me one for Christmas, that would be wonderful. <laughs> I got that window all patched up. So, what should I do now? What's next? What's next? What do you think is next? Well, you've been the one giving me tasks for two days straight. <laughs> What's next is you sit in that room until September 1st and call me at the first sign of smoke. Oh, yeah. Why don't you let me know when you're mentally prepared for that task and uh, I'll give it to you. Okay, I think I am ready to tackle my long-term commitment of keeping this national forest safe from total destruction. <laughs> I am glad to hear you've really thought this through. You know, I'm gonna hike around for a while before I really put my nose to the grindstone. Oh, yeah, you do that. Okay, now I'm ready. <laughs> Let's get to work. How were those precious few seconds of jobless freedom? Oh, magical. Good. Now get to work. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I'm only kidding, we're gonna stay. <laughs> yeah, not now, I'm not actually recording right now. Live, you know, I mean, I'm not, I'm not streaming right now, of course I'm recording. You're watching this, aren't you? Wow. Having a nice afternoon? No. Not too bad. I could get used to it out here. That's nice. Look, um, I called with bad news. Two young women, Chelsea Stevens and Lily McLean, were reported missing. They've got parents out in California who haven't heard from them in a week. They were supposed to meet an aunt down in Cody. If they're the girls from last week, then... You're probably the last person to have seen him. Uh, you should tell whoever that I'm happy to be questioned. Look, it's not going to be an issue. Uh, I mean, if, if they turn up dead, then maybe. Should I just not say anything and save us the trouble? I guess it's worth mentioning, though. I, I think it's worth mentioning something. Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll keep it vague. I, I really don't want to talk to the cops. Me neither. All right, Henry, thanks. Enjoy the sunset. Well, those were a quick few days, I guess. <laughs> so this is now, of course, day 15. Already? Yeah, a big shout out as well to, uh, let's see who we got here. Jake Rodkin Henry. as well. Henry, wake up. Get out of bed and pick up the radio. What do you want? Hey, you big dumb idiot. You're a big dumb idiot. <laughs> oh, baby, you sound tired. Mm, I am. Are you having a nice time? Uh, I don't know. There's some weird stuff going on. Oh, that's too bad. Mm hmm. I'm sure it'll be fine. Well, I'll let you get back to sleep then. Mm, okay, Jules. Delilah seems nice. Mm-hmm, sure. Bye, baby. Okay. I honestly forgot about that part. Yeah, but I was wondering, Jake is actually one of the guys in, you know, who have to make Firewatch as well.
Here we go, so hike north. pain in the ass to bring supplies all the way up to our towers? Well, I get my stuff hand-delivered. Oh, how's that work? <laughs> the perks of a decade of service. You're out hiking in 90-degree heat, and I get to do crosswords. Isn't life miserably unfair? Anyway, when you find the supply drop, remember it's not just for you, okay? Other lookouts, biologists, a few people get their food there, and I don't want to have to call in for more. There should be loads of good stuff, though. Beans, prunes, jerky. You know, my sister eats six prunes a day. Six. She's, like, really precise about it. She'd be great at this job if she didn't need wheelbarrows full of marijuana to function. Jesus Christ. I thought I'd actually go to work, you know, run through the tree, but so, no. like, two weeks ago, you called me in the middle of the night. You were sleeping, I guess, and all I heard was the name Jules through the mumbles. I just thought it was so sweet. I wanted to wake you up, but then I thought maybe you were having a nice conversation and I'd just be spoiling it. I hope you're doing okay, you know, when it comes to her. I shouldn't be out here. Yes, you should. No, I just ran away from my problems. No, you didn't. We all fuck up. Oh, look. So, a couple of months before I took this job, I... I was with this guy, Javier. Oh, he's incredible. Caring, sexy as hell. He was a driller down in Casper. We dated for almost five years. I was working with the Wyoming Outdoor Leadership School, and I was obsessed with it. I wanted to be an instructor so badly. And I was sure I was going to marry Javier as soon as I could be bothered. Walls was also a good excuse to get out of town, drink whiskey in the mountains, cut loose. <sighs> then, um, Javier's brother got killed working in Gillette, and for some reason, I didn't come home. Javier said it was fine. He'd go to the funeral, take care of his mom, stuff like that. It'd be easier solo. When he came back, he left me. I came out here. I lied and told my sister he fucked our neighbor. So, I lied to you. I came out here with a broken heart just like you. <sighs> I figured you've told me so much about you. So, you know, there's something about me. We both fucked up. Okay. Yeah, I was saying this on Twitter earlier on. Firewatch, I think it's one of those games where you don't need commentary. I guess, you know, me talking in a video right now. You don't necessarily need it for this type of game. And I think this game especially, you can get away with it. Hey, I'm out at a ravine. What's this thing that spans across it? That is how you get to my sector. No kidding. Well, let me hike over. It's locked up and mainly for emergencies. I've never actually used it. Rangers use it from time to time, but that's it. Help! Oh God, it's an emergency! <laughs> oh really? Yeah, I got, I got um, I got eyes on a tornado. I got to get out of here. A tornado in the heart of the Rockies? Yes. <laughs> Holy moly! I need to call this in. Tom, Two Forks sees a tornado. He says he needs an evac into my sector. It's a meteorological impossibility. There haven't been tornadoes in the greater Yellowstone region in a hundred million years. You're gonna need him to stay and take a detailed personal account, even if it means giving his life. Okay, I'll tell him. <laughs> Sorry, Hank. No dice. Man, found the supplies. Oh, good. Uh, enjoy. All right, I got everything I need out of here. Time to chow down. Just yours, right? Who do you think I am? <laughs> I talk all three. <laughs> Screw you, Delilah. Now we are on day 34.
So I guess that spoiler up to day 64 is getting to know Delilah hey, as well. You didn't take all of the supply drop food, did you? <laughs> um because remember it was for a lot of people like five. I'm hungry. So you did. I got to go. <laughs> What if I said no? <laughs> yeah, so like I said before, regardless of what, you know, answer you respond, the story is the exact same, but it's your own experience, you know, of, you know, from A to B, if you get me. If that made any sense at all? Yeah? No? Maybe so? Uh oh. Front row seat for what might be the biggest fire of the year. Yeah, it's really going. I'm gonna call it in. They'll send in a hotshot crew for some suppression, but I bet we'll be stuck with her for the rest of the summer. And she doesn't have a name yet. I usually think of something funny or something practical or a little risque when coming up with them. But why don't you do the honors? So, no ideas, huh? Uh, maybe we call it the Flapjack Fire. Can you sell that as a name? You really like that, huh? Yeah, I said I did. It's funny. Fair enough. Flapjack Fire it is. They'll probably ask me if it was a camp cooking accident or something. So there's this creek down the hill, and, um, you know what my favorite thing to do is? What's that? I love to take a bottle of whatever I have on hand, plunge it deep into the water, and let it chill in there all day. And then, on nights like tonight, when it is so disgustingly hot, I have something nice and cool to drink. I learned that from my sister in Santa Fe. She'd do that with a bottle of tequila near her house and make margaritas the size of your head. <laughs> You'd like it there. I've had one too many bad experiences with tequila. I'm a little reticent to try it again. Well, maybe you just need a new, good experience with it. Uh, yeah, maybe. Are you looking at the fire? Uh, no, I'm not. You should. Let me know when you are. Back here. Okay, I'm looking at it again. I love how they look at night. During the day, it's just smoke, but when the sun is down, you can just get lost. Yeah. I'm glad you're here. Why do you say that? <laughs> because I do. I'm not crazy. I mean, we've had such a good time, right? Yeah, I think so. I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you. Not in the same way. And I know you're not really available, but <laughs> I want you to know, well, maybe it'd be nice to get together at the end of the summer. Um... Look, we don't have to plan or even talk about it. I'm, I'm just having the thought. I wish I was over there. to be near somebody. We could talk. We got these radios. We could, um, you know. <sighs> It'd be nice to be close to someone. Why don't we both just go watch this fire and try to imagine all the old dead things that's burning away. Yeah, there we go. Okay, now is a spoiler. This is the fourth last day. But stuff gets really good up here.
time fishing without a license? It's one fish, and I'm sick of all the stuff I got to eat. Well, maybe you shouldn't have taken so much of it then. That reminds me, I keep hearing reports from Fish and Game about a problem there they're trying to keep tabs on. Can you search around the lake for fresh tracks and just let me know what you find? There was a crew burning fire lines out to the east, and, um, you know, I think sometimes it riles up the wildlife. Huh. Problem bear? Fuck that. I am of the opinion that they are all problems. <laughs> Come on, please. Ugh. Can't believe I'm gonna leave this planet as a pile of bear shit. Thank you, Henry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now this is interesting. Trust me. What the, uh, D? I found a clipboard down here and I, uh, there's something strange going on. At the lake? What's up? Someone has written down what we said to each other, have been saying. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you, not in the same way. No way. Wait, hold on. Something's out here. Henry? I'm worried. You didn't find and eat any mushrooms, did you? I mean, they can be fun, but also, you know, devastating. Oh, lovely. Frightened me too, even though I know it was coming, it frightened me too. Are you there? What happened, Henry? I... Holy hell, I just... I got hit in the head. Punched or something by someone. Are you serious? What the hell is going on out there? I don't know. Jesus Christ. Let me get this straight. You found a clipboard with... What? Transcripts of our conversations? What else is on it? I don't know. It's gone. Along with a radio of theirs. Somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. I don't... What the fuck is going on? What's Wapiti Station? I, I... I... I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station right before I was cold cocked. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to you? Uh... Wapiti Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's... It's on our map. It's not too far from where you are right now. I'm hiking through the canyon. Which way is my best bet for getting to Wapiti Meadow? It looks like you can find a trail on the north shore of Jonesy Lake, towards the west. Thanks, Dee. So we are here. There's Wappy Station there, so... Keep going straight ahead and then take a left. You should be okay. Yeah, even though I knew it was coming, <laughs> I still jumped. <laughs> I was pressing the wrong button for some reason. I was pressing B. But, uh... Well, are, are the other lookouts telling the truth? Of course. Why wouldn't they be? I don't know. Maybe someone told them not to. You're suggesting that you and I are actually being watched by whom, exactly? You know, people. As opposed to, what, aliens? Mad scientists? The CIA? Wild separatists? The, the fucking Illuminati? Come on! Look, you should have seen this clipboard, Delilah. Yeah, I guess I should have. Keep your radio close to you. Hey, what you just said, keep my radio close to me. Yeah? Before I got attacked back at the lake, I saw a radio on the ground. Kind of like the one I use. And? Do you think that maybe someone was 
you know, uh... I don't know. What? Maybe intercepting our frequency with other radios or something. Henry... It's just a thought. I, I don't even know how you would do that. Yeah, well, you sound worried. No, I'm not, okay? Let's not spin out of control. Just keep hiking. Whatever you say, boss. Okay, I'm curious. Do any of you believe her at all? Let me know in the comment section below. We are here. Okay. I just took the wrong turn. Oh, I didn't. No, I have to keep going up here and then left. Okay. Yeah, so as you can see, some locations might take a while to get to, but uh, I'll go up this way. Okay, so I guess as you heard early on, you know, she wanted to meet up and everything, you know, do this and do that with each other. She seems, you know, really keen on it. But, uh, just remember everything that you hear in the game. That's all I'll say. So up here, we're nearly there. Be up here on the left hand side, we take a turn. Yeah. Okay. So here we go, we go to the right here, and then, yeah. Back to where the fence was. Which was uh, part two, if I'm correct, of my let's play. Wrong way completely.
So we need to get in somehow. Hmm. Let's see if we can get around it somehow. Damn ear is it Yeah, so Henry for Smash anyone? <laughs> Did you see that sweet uh Henry is fired up? In circuits again or something. Maybe it's good that I got that done, you know, out of the way. Eh, oh well. Up here on the right hand side. I'm curious to know what you think of the performance, sorry, the performance of the game anyway. Let's touch a rope, at least it's done. What's over here? Let's read. Uh, okay.
What is over here again? Isn't there something here? I can't remember exactly what it is. Oh, oh yeah, the turtle. <laughs> so let's adopt a turtle, will we? Yeah. So we now have our own pet turtle. Yeah, so I guess if you want to find the turtle of the you know, in the game, that's it there. I think we can take some photos here, can we? Of something. All right, let's go. Come on, really? Okay, so as you can see, we need to chop the tree down. Okay, I'm at the fence. I don't see anyone around, but I'm not sure I can get past it. Looks like goddamn Area 51. Maybe they've got aliens. That'd be exciting. Yeah, we'll see about that. And what are the odds they left the gate on the way? Pretty low, I'd imagine. Okay. Um, I've, I've given it the good college try. Uh, no dice. <sighs> Shit. I, I don't know how long I can dick around out here until someone notices. God, if you were an actual firefighter, you'd have that gate down in two shakes. Hey, actually, those guys doing the controlled burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. Can we get through south of Ruby River? Ruby. We are here. Where is Ruby? You kidding me? From there to there. This way, where, which way are we going now? Yeah.
No, I want to go back the other way. Sorry. Not that way. Is it this way? Yeah, okay, grand. Okay. Map away. Yeah, guys, can you believe that this day, next week, is Christmas Day? That's insane. It is also six days towards Impact Direct. Nice little surprise, I guess. I'm wandering around east of the lake. Which way is Ruby River? It's in the southeast corner of your map. The scout camp where the firefighters were staged should be on your map. It looks like a little triangle with a flat bottom. Yeah, it looks like a tent. How did I never see that before? Yeah, so it is the right way. Just making sure. <laughs> Come on, Henry, you can do it. Where'd I come out of the trees, like? Yeah, if you haven't checked, you know, if you haven't got this game, maybe I should do a video on it. I have played this game in handheld for a few minutes. Let's turn right here. That's right. But, uh, I know oh, it's we gorgeous. I what's going on yet, but I don't have a good feeling. I don't like feeling vulnerable. It's not like you can just call the police. I was thinking about the good ones. It just struck me that if anything weird like this happened to them, happened to Brian, just how scared he would have been. He had his dad to protect him. Ned, right? Yeah. You don't think he could? No, you're you're probably right. I found where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Yeah, normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but... I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks, now that there's someone in it. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see. The scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. Got it. What happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Uh, are you serious? <laughs> oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. Oh, look, it's the opposite way. If I'm correct, there's absolutely nothing over there. Where are we? Just to show you, take a look. Yeah, baby.
Oh, that was like the first butterfly we've seen in the game. I think. Okay, so straight ahead. What's this? There's some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Whoa, someone stripped these snowmobiles down to the bone. Huh. And that's weird, right? I mean, I can come up with a bunch of not weird reasons someone would do that out here, but given what's happened, yeah. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, there's an old pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Pork Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um, well, folks kept stealing it. Pork Pond. Uh, because it's called Pork Pond? It's a good goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den, or, you know, anywhere. Here we go. Camp Arapaho. You're there? Yeah, I am. The bridge to the camp is out. Damn. I'm gonna walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. he suck all right weird you ever talked to any of the scouts no they haven't been out here in a while and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the wee blows for the past 35 years yeah See if we can find whatever we have to find. Yeah, these guys are gone. They found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Damn. Uh, I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. It looks like an axe to me. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the backcountry and getting through that fence. Hey, D, they left something behind. It's like a memo from their boss. Does it say anything of note? Ugh. Wow.
I guess let's go back. What is that? Weird. Let's go over this direction, will we? Okay, we can cut this tree down. <coughs> Anything over here? No. No, there is not. Oh, what is that? So, uh, here's a funny thing about old Delilah. Okay. I'm a bit of a pack rat. I have no doubt that this is relevant information. I keep everything. I mean, I have an entire drawer of parking tickets from, like, <laughs> seven states. Wow, that's very thorough, yet completely irresponsible of you. Congrats. But... I'm not so good with the following up with stuff part. So those parking tickets... Yeah, they're all unpaid. I'm the scourge of every meter made from here to Mexico. Anywho, um, I was digging through all of my documents and memos and updates, and I found something from April about a fence in the middle of the woods at Wapiti Meadows. Delilah. No, oh, I know. It's about how we're supposed to report any damage to our bosses. Or university officials. University? Because they're doing some sort of study. It's a research site. So, the question is, what do we think they're studying? Us. They're researching us. You, you think they're studying you and me? I do, yeah. I mean, maybe it's about studying two strangers who talk every day. Like, if you put someone in isolation with someone else, what they do. Yeah, that's what I think. Well, fuck that! Agreed. <laughs> I think we should allow for the possibility that this is all just a big misunderstanding, but... God, if you saw what you said you did... Fuck, Henry. Yeah, I saw it. Okay. So what's next? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. <coughs> Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like another lookout, could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. What about when I heard you talking to someone else? I just left your line open. That's not what this is. Get in your tower. Shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Wow. Maybe we will uh, leave it there, guys, will we? That's some scary shit there. Whew. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. 
The flapjack fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? <laughs> uh, you can do me for a trip out of here. I don't care if it's on horseback or a helicopter or in a canoe. Just get me out of here. Henry, we have work left to do. Let's chat about what's bothering you and you'll feel better. Are you serious? Let's talk. Okay? Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. it it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. Um, which tree am I supposed to internalize again? <laughs> Top row, second from the left. Head to a place named after that tree, and you'll have a wonderful afternoon. Alright guys, I think we'll leave it there. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this. I guess that's a, a, another hour? A Firewatch on Switch? So the next part will be you know, coming very soon. You can of course check us out on YouTube, Twitter and Instagram. And more Nintendo and Indies keep it right here. Alright guys, stay fresh.